Hello everybody and welcome to Wisconsin Prep Zone's WIAA State Individual Wrestling Roundtable. I'm Rob Hernandez from the State Journal, joined by Dennis Sumrall, Cassie Paulson, our wrestling experts here as we get ready for three days of fun at the Cole Center. Dennis, we start first in Division One. A couple of defending state champions in the area to keep an eye out. That's probably where we should start when we're talking about area hopefuls. Stephen Furseth of Janesville, Craig, and uh, John Wells of Milton. That's correct. Stephen Furseth, 166-4 and four in his career, four-time state qualifier. He had three of his four losses have actually come at the state tournament. His last one was in the finals his sophomore year. 81-0 and 0 over the last two years, moved up a weight from 130 to 135, seated number one in the state most of the year. Then you also have to look at John Wells from Milton. He moved up from 103 to 112. Not as, uh, he's got a few more losses this year. He's got eight losses, and he's uh, ranked seventh in the state. But uh, defending state champs don't go down easy, so. They sure don't. The other one to look at is Ian Johnson, ranked number one at 171, state runner up at 160 last year for Milton. Milton with several uh, wrestlers in the field. Uh, Cassie, Wisconsin Rapids qualifies 12. It seems like the, the powerful programs always bring a lot to the state tournament. Absolutely. I mean, anytime you have a program like that, they just they, they always rebuild. Kids will learn from the older wrestlers as they go on. They just keep getting better, keep getting better, and that's why they keep sending as many wrestlers as they do to the state tournament. And Dennis, finally, uh, you do have one guy to look at, Germantown. Jesse Thielke going sure. for four titles. He'd be the only the 11th wrestler all time to get it. He has one loss, 181-1 and one in his four-year career. And I believe just recently got an invite to the Olympic Training Center, and he's one of those guys that we'll see a lot of beyond just this WI state tournament. Dennis, anybody else that comes to mind, whether they be in the area, out of the area, but uh, certainly in the area. I know Stoughton's got a few wrestlers, but uh, anybody else that you think can, can come on and perhaps contend for a state title? I, I Keep an eye on Stoughton sophomore uh, Jesse Nelson. Uh, he's only been in wrestling a couple years. He was a basketball player in eighth grade. He's got uh, just a wide range of potential, and I think he'll be one that the fans will like to see at the heavyweight division. All right. 3 o'clock on uh, Thursday, the Division One preliminary start down at the Cole Center. Dennis Semra will be there anchoring our coverage on Thursday. Cassie will join him on Friday along with Mike Kabish. And uh, we'll all be there Saturday for the state finals, the March of Champions. And you can catch all the action on our live blogs and on Twitter here on WisconsinPrepZone.com. For Dennis and Cassie, I'm Rob Hernandez. Thanks for joining us here on our WIA State Wrestling Roundtable.